Okay, ladies and gentlemen, eBayers and YouTubers, this is another custom that I am very proud of. Um, he was constructed from the, the base of a, a Venom figure from a Marvel Classics, I believe it was. I uh, went ahead and uh, took out his tongue and took off about half of his face to reveal more of the insane look. Um, this is a this is my uh, custom Carnage figure. Uh, I like to think of this guy as uh, the Hell Carnage. Yes, underneath uh, all this nasty symbiote goo, there is a metal frame under here, so it allows all of these tendrils to uh, bend. If you will, you can pose them in any position you'd like. Um, they're all removable. These are removable. So there's one, two, there's uh, four, four of the uh, bendable tendrils are removable. But this thing in the back, from what you're about to see, this is not removable. This spine type looking thing. That is not removable. It's just, you know, part of the maximum carnage. Um, he's very poseable. He's a 7 inch tall figure. I left this side of his face alone. So it looks like this, you know. But I you can see where I added in to where it looks like the symbiote's about to take over his face right here. Um. All around a beautiful figure. Took me a very long time to paint and redo some areas and add all the 3D puff paint acrylic. A lot of this paint you're seeing is actually three dimensional. It's risen from the surface, so it gives it a really, a true to life, real feeling look, if you will. But, um, yes, this is just an all around super cool kick ass figure. I added these spiky look like almost things. Yeah, I don't know if you guys saw the end of the tendrils are uh, pointy, almost you know, scorpion looking. But yes, this is going to be available for sale, and and will be on eBay to anybody who's interested in this. But alright guys, I'm gonna call this quits. Later.